Now, your KRBC Storm Team forecast with meteorologist Grant Tosteru. A beautiful start to the work week out there as you take a look on SkyCam. Sun starting to come up. A few clouds out there, though. Skies are mostly sunny to get your day started. And temperatures on the warm side yet again. 73 degrees here in Abilene. Taking a look on the horizon, though, there's a little bit of haze out there. It's the humidity that's made its way in. It's going to be sticking around today. A very muggy start to your Monday morning as that tropical moisture starts to make or continues to make its way in. We're still going to see highs warm to around 90 degrees this afternoon. That would tie for the coolest afternoon high we've seen so far in the month of June. As we drop into the mid 90s on your Tuesday, that will be the coolest afternoon high we've seen so far this month. But after that, enjoy that very brief cool down heading today and into tomorrow because after that, our temperatures start warming up once again. Skies remaining partly sunny through Wednesday. We'll see more sunshine Thursday into Friday as we return into the mid 90s yet again to wrap up your week. Rain chances, though, that's what we'll be talking about through Wednesday into Thursday towards the end of this week. It's going to remain fairly low, though. That's the bad news. Just a 20% chance here in Abilene for the next four days or so. So that increases, especially off to the southeast, thanks to this tropical disturbance off the Gulf of Mexico. I'll shut in just a second, but by Friday, as we wrap up your week, those rain chances really going to start to move out of here as we enter a little bit more of a dry pattern heading into the weekend. So taking a look at future radar, could also already see a few isolated showers through Brown County, Comanche County, down towards Goldthwaite already by 8 o'clock this morning. Now there's still a lot of uncertainty into the rain chances and locations really all week long, but I really think this is going to be the best chance heading later into this afternoon. Those rain chances mainly going to be confined off to the southeast, even off to the west. There's a few isolated rain chances possible with some moisture making its way actually off from the Pacific. So it's kind of we're sandwiched in between two different things here really all week long. By tomorrow, here comes that chance for isolated showers yet again, mainly points southeast of Abilene. And that's going to be kind of the same story as you head into Wednesday. Rain chances potentially increase off to the east of Abilene. But watch as we head towards the afternoon. This is Wednesday morning. Wednesday afternoon, a weak front's going to make its way in from the north. And that could bring healthier rain chances as we head through Wednesday afternoon, possibly even into Thursday. So we may bump those rain chances up just a little bit later this evening, even by tomorrow morning. So like I said here, in Abilene. We're going to be kind of sandwiched in between those two areas. Just a 20% chance for an isolated shower here in Abilene. That 30% chance off to the west, including Snyder, or Sweetwater and Snyder. And another 30% chance off to the southeast. This includes Comanche and Brown. But this rain will remain very isolated today. As we warm into the 90s across most of the big country, staying in the upper 80s down towards Brownwood and Comanche today. 70 degrees by tomorrow morning with that 20% chance for an isolated shower lingering around. But it's going to remain muggy as we head through Wednesday into Thursday when those rain chances start to taper off. Returning into the mid and upper 90s again 